on YouTube, I'm at the peak of Mont Royal. It's been quite the fucking hike. I took a shortcut. Most people that take the trails, I kind of just like took these off trails here and just like cut through the fucking forest all the way down. Yeah, I'm not really orientated. I actually don't know the way back, so I'm gonna have to figure that out. Being out in the mountains uh, really lets me appreciate life, appreciate nature, you know? Feeling more like a monk every day. Yeah, fuck it, I might just uh, live out here. I might just take full residence up in these mountains and meditate on the finest rock. It looks like a little bit of a shortcut. But yeah, this kind of reminds me of like something Nietzsche talked about. Where it's pretty much like the greater the goal you set and achieve, the greater the man you have to become. So it's like, for example, going to Montreal on my own, that takes some nuts, that takes a certain type of person. And to achieve it and do it, um, you'll grow from it. Like, not just anybody can kind of thing. Like hiking this mountain. Um, I've grown simply just by hiking a mountain. It's a goal I set and I achieved it. And so yeah, since I uh, went out and set this goal and achievement, I am now a greater person than I was um, because of it. I'm tempted to take these uh, last detour routes. They just look so, like so much fun for this. I just plan on taking a nice little walk. I was not expecting to be fucking galloping down a hill. Well, it definitely is quicker. Fuck, it. This is deep. Whoa. Man, looks like uh, my fellow traveler wasn't as fortunate as I. I'll continue the journey for you, buddy. I'll honor you in your afterlife, squirrel. Oh, no way. <laughs> okay, it's not that bad. Yeah. Okay, well, I'm going to have to get back to you. This is quite the trail. I wish I got that fucking camera. I sl <laughs> I fucking damn near smacked my head on a rock and slid down this entire fucking thing. My god, that was a ride. Fuck me. That was scary though. I'm so grateful I did not smack my head on one of those rocks. That would have been that would have sucked. Man, I really need some hiking shoes. I got this little bit to traverse and then I'm back on the road. Yeah, it does, the camera does not do justice to this fucking trail. That was absolutely nuts. I don't know how the fuck I did that in these shoes. Anyways, continuing the journey. Oh yeah, mountain in the background, fucking time flies. It feels like a second ago that I was walking up dreading each and every step I would have to take to get to the top. But now that it's done, uh, I feel very satisfied with the efforts. I'm glad I put the effort in. I'm glad I pushed through the dread of having to fucking climb that mountain. Yeah, right now I think I'm on. Park Street or Park Avenue or some shit. It seems very. Have a lot of graffiti. It's like artsy kind of area, but it's not really high end. It's actually a little bit like grungy in a good way. <clears throat> a lot of like street graffiti and shit. Um, it's not like one of those artsy fartsy well places. Like like they're trying to be artsy. It's not like that. It just, just kind of is. You know. On the topic of like exploration and shit, like, I don't know, when you explore places that you haven't been to, you almost integrate a piece of that 
uh, a piece of it with you, kind of. So it's like the more places you explore, the more integrated you are. And the more integrated you are, the more of a person you are, I assume. And the more broader your judgments are, and the more broader your standing is on life, and the more broader your point of view is. So, like for example, if you only lived in some little buttfuck town in the middle of nowhere, then your opinions will be pretty, pretty centralized opinions. You wouldn't really, you wouldn't really have any differing opinions or point of view or anything like that. But if you're somebody that travels the world all the time, is always exploring and updating and adding to their uh, field of vision, then you'll be a very well integrated, very broad person.